today's video, we played some 2v2s, getting back into the swing of things, really focusing and making sure that I, you know, just play above the level of the lobby. One of the biggest tendencies I talk about in this video that I have is just playing to the speed of the lobby and not playing independent of the skill of the lobby. Well, today we're going to be trying to fix that error and trying to play up to the speed that I know that I can and up to the level that I know I can play. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you all in game number one. All right, game number one, we got Freaky Bob on our team playing against Swift and it's Tuxy. Let's focus up. Let's lock in. I'm tired of being at this low MMR, you know? Tired of not being Grand Champ 3, tired of not getting closer to SSL every day, right? I'm just tired of losing, and I'm definitely, you know, not to toot my own horn, right? But I do think that I'm a little bit more skilled than the MMR I'm in, but it just comes down to actually focusing and actually making sure to show that I am that skill, you know, by consistently making plays that are better than the rank that I'm at, right? Because I can't really say that I'm, I'm a better player than the rank that I'm at if I'm not consistently playing better, right? Because if I was consistently playing better, I would be scoring a lot more and I would be winning a lot more games. So hopefully we can uh, we can show that today. Good play for my teammate there. Just making sure to play behind him. All right. Good 50 as well. I'll get behind. Let him go for that. Okay. Go for a shot. He should be able to go. I'll let Freaky Bob take it. Nice. I'll be mid now. Maybe he wants to touch that. Doubt it. All right, Tuxy's gonna be on that. I'll just wait in the net. All right, I can go for that. Nice, I knew that I could beat him there. And I knew that even though I could beat him, I really couldn't follow up on that. So I'm just gonna touch it, use as little boost as possible. Good shot. A little bit slow, but I mean, that's fine. For how quickly I had to get up to that, I'm actually fine if I don't score that immediately. You know, it just gets good pressure. It forces them to make a play. I'll be mid here. He got beat. Nice, good shot. Great pass. A little bit, you know, maybe more difficult than it had to be, but that's fine that it went up there and, you know, we got the read anyway, so we're good. All right. We got three minutes left. Two goals up. That's a good start. I do feel really solid right now, so I just got to make sure I keep that up and make sure I don't lose focus. Sometimes I can tend to lose focus after a couple of games or after, you know, just, just playing like solidly for a little bit because I just assume that I'm going to keep on playing solidly. And that's not what I can do. I, I need to just stay focused and stay locked in the entire time. Otherwise, I'll start autopiloting. I'll start mimicking the speed of the lobby and the plays that the players around me are making. And that's just not good, you know? Obviously, if I want to play better than the people around me, I need to just play better. Which sounds, like, obvious, but, you know, if I fall into the habit of autopiloting, I'm just going to copy what everybody else is doing in the lobby. And then I'll just play at the same level as everybody else in the lobby. So, not good to do that. Should be fine there. I think Freaky Bob's got a... Okay, it's an open net. I don't think they're trying anymore. Yeah, I think that's a, that's a forfeit from them. Uh, one of them probably voted to forfeit. The other one probably didn't. And then he's just kind of throwing the game. I think. I mean, I, I don't know. I, I don't think anybody at this rank, like, leaves the net open like that. So, I don't know. It doesn't really seem like they're trying anymore. Unless they are. I don't know. Maybe they are. I'll just hit up high here. Hopefully he can go for it. Good save. Low boost. He's not challenging me. He is though. Should be free. I can't go for that though. I'll let him take it. Maybe he can stay on. I'll go for a pancake reset here. Nice. Good shot there. Thanks. See, he thought that I was going to shoot it straight away. Uh, which I could have, right? But because he was on the backboard, I just decided get the pancake. Reset and uh, get the uh, get the goal. So, anyways, we'll get right into game number two. See you all then. All right, game number two. We got playing against the Squid and Andrew Raids and K Pyro on our team. I'll wait on him. Nice. Maybe just get a shot. Okay. Good goal. Good goal from K Pyro. Not really much to comment on there. Just a good hit off the wall, good follow, and then one of their guys went for boost instead of going for the ball. And we just get a free goal. All right, they're both pretty far back here, so I'll just try to take a soft touch, maybe bait him into a 50. Nice, my teammate gets a good follow up there. Gets a backflip as well. All right, I'll wait on this. The squid's gonna have it, so I'll let him take. All right, I'll go for this. 
Even though I do get beat there, I do force him to hit it over me. And now he does a good job to actually get the ball around and keep possession of it. But at the same time, you know, he's not really doing much. Um, plus, it does just kind of slow down his attack a little bit. I wish my teammate would have just gone there. Uh, playing that passive when we're both, like, right on top of each other is just not a good idea. Somebody's got to go for the ball. All right, I'll take this full boost here. Gonna wait on this. Maybe you can go. Nice. I'll play behind him. I'll wait on Andrew. Alright. K Pyro's gonna have that. Nice. I'll wait on these. This guy. Nice. I'll stay on this. Try to get a demo onto Squid. Nice. Good touch. Good demo on him. I think my teammate's gonna be able to challenge this as well. Perfect. You know, they're not gonna have a shot there, so I'm gonna go for a pinch. Ooh, almost. It was online. Uh, it was, you know, on the net there, but unfortunately we just couldn't. Didn't get enough power or I guess direction, like slash speed, you know? All right, I'm gonna control this to the corner. Oh wow, he took my boost. And the other guy was pressuring the ball. That is crazy. One of them took the boost and the other one was pressuring the ball. I had two of them on me. I'll play mid here. Nah, he's just gonna shoot that. That's fine. I just need him to recover here. Just saw that he got the corner boost and they're hitting back to him anyways. You know, people in this rank tend to just hit the ball without any real direction. You know? So, a lot of the times they're uh, making clears and stuff like that without any um, threat. Or, you know, they're not like getting possession or anything like that. gonna fake this oh close oh no don't tell me that's a goal oh I think we're good yeah yeah I wish he just didn't touch that that's fine though good demo just flip that far nice I forced that one guy to jump off the backboard nice I'll just wait on this try to get a demo onto squid got him all right Hey, Pyro should be able to get that. Wait on Andrew. Nice. I'll just fake this, let him go. Okay, perfect. I got this now. Try to get a demo on one. Good musty. I'll just wait on this, you know, just trying to buy my teammate time to get into a proper position there. And try to get the ball upfield, you know, at the same time. Right, he's not going to have that. I'll just pop that up high. Make sure to hit it with the top of my car. Just to make sure that I don't like get dunked or anything like that. Uh, just wanted to play very safe, very careful. All right, I can go for this. Okay, should hit the ceiling. It's not going to. Hit it over. Okay, he actually got demoed. I got to get back now. That's fine. I'll play some pads here. Nice, good touch. All right. I should be able to grab this corner boost. Looks like K-Pyro is going to go for a 50. Should be fine. I mean, he can touch that, you know? I'm not really too worried about the sidewall, even if he does get it. Um, it's not really gonna um, be that threatening of a shot on my net. I gotta get back here. Nice save from my teammate. I wasn't sure whether or not he was gonna be able to get that, but that was a really good read from him. Good on him to save the flip there. Should be fine. Okay, I can go for that. Never mind, he wants it. That's fine. I'll get mid, just to follow up the shot if he takes it. Uh, yeah. Pinch that. Okay, he did kind of just back off of that. Hopefully my teammate just goes. Yes, no. Okay, this guy, sometimes his challenge, his challenges on defense are very confusing. Go, go, go! Oh, why would he let them do that? Okay, so right there, because I bumped him off of the ball, he's got to recognize that, like how much time and space there is to go for the ball. But I mean, that was a good pinch, don't get me wrong, but that was that was really bad like i said it, it's a it's a matter of you know not knowing when to challenge on defense um that really kind of killed him there okay i'll wait on his touch i gotta fake that because the squid's gonna beat me there and i'll let him go i'll just kind of back up towards it i don't want to actually you know i don't want to actually challenge that until i know that my teammate is going to be ready for it great shot I don't want to challenge that until I know that my teammate's going to be ready for it. So, you know, I'm not actually going to go for the ball um, until, you know, kind of just see how fast he's getting back. See, you know, how long it would take him to get a boost. 
right? And then once I know that he has boost and is probably moving up the field, that's when I start to challenge. Nice, GG. We'll get right into game number three. See you all then. All right, game number three. We got K Pyro again uh, and just Max and Alexa. So hopefully we can get some dubs here. Just want to get uh, another solid game here. That's all we really need. We don't really need to do anything too crazy. Uh, I just need to keep in mind the tendencies of my teammate and, you know, try to just play around him, basically. Try to just make the game as easy as possible for him. I'm not going to be able to go here. All right, they got a reset. Need help. Nice. That was a good air dribble, um, but not quite threatening enough. Plus, to get it over me, obviously had to air dribble it into the crossbar. So it just doesn't work out for him. Try to get a demo. Ah, man. I think if I have a slightly taller hitbox there, you know, like an Octane or a Fennec, uh, or well, just Octane hitbox in general, uh, I think I actually just get the demo there and it's probably a free goal, but I didn't expect him to be able to jump so fast. Great pass for my teammate. All right, I'll cheat up here. Take this. Wait on K Pyro. All right, I'll get back here. Let him take it. Try to get a demo on Just Max. Try to see if I can just bump him out. Maybe a free shot. No, nah, okay. I'll wait on Alexa here. All right, they're gonna go for that. Nice, fake that. You can go. I'll play under him now. Lex is gonna be there. All right. Just wait on this. Nice. Max is gonna be on. I can't really do much there. Hopefully, K Pyro can just go for that. Beautiful. Good challenge. I'm a little awkward here. I'll let Alexa go. All right. Nice. Right on this. I'll fake. Just wait on just Max. All right. I got this. I'm gonna wait this, get a reset, see if I can get a pinch. All right, they're not gonna let me. He might be able to take a shot there. It's a tough angle, but there we go. Nice shot. Beautiful, good 50 from us. Good fake. All right, I'll cheat up here. Nice, I got this. I gotta shoot that on. Oh, I couldn't get, like, around the ball enough. Well, I got around the ball too much, basically. I couldn't get back around the other side of the ball after I got around the ball the first time. <laughs> um, yeah, I just didn't get uh, a good enough angle on the net there to take a take a solid shot. Try to get a bump on one, though. Get a bump on another. All right, Alexa's a little bit awkward, so I'll wait on this. All right, so I'll take this. Try to get over. I can't get that. Hopefully, K Pyro can get a touch. Nice. Ideally here, if he's able to follow it up and maybe get one more touch, that's good, but this is fine as well. I mean, we both have full boost. He's just dribbling it across the net. Uh, you know, I knew that they didn't really have any chance of scoring that, so there's no point in me jumping and wasting boost and putting myself out of position when all I really have to do is sit underneath the ball and they're just going to end up air dribbling the ball around me, you know? Maybe they can get that off the spawn. I kind of left him in a bad spot. That's my bad. I didn't think that Just Max was going to be able to actually get that around me. Good shot, though. Good usage of boost as well to hit the ball under K Pyro. That's going to be a bit awkward. Oh my... I got bumped into that, dude. No. I was trying to bump them, but of course they just like drove alongside of me and they ended up bumping me into my teammate. Yeah, that's tough. That's a really tough one, to be honest. Nice. Good save. He's going to be on that, I think. Okay, should be a free ball for my teammate. He did backflip, but it should be all right. I don't think they're up. Okay, they actually weren't. Ugh. I didn't think they were up, but I didn't want to risk it and get dunked. Oh, he took both of the boosts. I have nothing here. I did not like that he took both of the boosts there. I don't think he meant to. <laughs> um, You know, because what teammate would it you know, meaningfully or, you know, intentionally take both of the boosts, but that's kind of messed up. 
All right, that's a good touch from us. Fortunately, we do get demoed for it, though. He should be able to just take a 50 there. Okay, ball goes kind of to the side. I can flip that onto the net. Maybe just get a touch under. Close. Okay, they both uh, got like a really bad recovery. I'll go for this boost. He might be off the ceiling. Can he go? Oh, we got dusted. He just got dusted. Yeah, that's, that's unlucky. I think he started to turn back when he saw the guy challenging off the ceiling. Yeah, and then he just decided to go anyways, which was not ideal. Um, I might have been able to stay in front of that ball, but I was trying to really leave it so that my teammate could go for the shot. And, you know, I, I left the ball just so that he knew that I wasn't going for it anymore. Whereas if I stay in front of it, you know, he might think that that I'm still going and then he might not go for the shot. That was just a... T how am I demoed? What? How, how am I bumping them and somehow I get demoed? I swear, man. I actually have the worst luck when it comes to that stuff. Hit it over. Eh. Kind of unlucky there. I'm trying to force the ball out. I need him to go. I need him to go for the ball. We have 18 seconds left and he's letting them dribble it on our half. You know? No way he recovers. How? How does he recover? Alright, GG's. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you on the next one. Peace.